So, welcome back to Judgment. Um, I was going back up to the barbecue place because I wanted to see if there was a friend event there, but... Hello? Nah, Yo, there isn't. Me. You find Ayabe yet? Negative. But I did track down someone who had a run-in with Hamura. Yeah? Is it good news? His alibi might be more airtight. You know, it's almost like if you put that... The Just phone from midnight up on the to day of the gear, you this could walk I got hit by Tamara, then saw it go to the <laughs> sauna. It was apparently right by. Q I feel like I could have actually walked and talked for this uh scene, but I just didn't. Oh. To it <laughs> Hold up, isn't that near KJR? Those Kyori guys won't be happy to see you. If I was worried about getting seen, I'd never leave the office. <laughs> Fair enough. Later. I mean, you could just wear a mask. That that could work too. Irashimase. I don't know what triggers hit, um, the friend event at Conrai, but you know what? I I think some Korean barbecue sounds pretty good right about now. Hell yeah! Gotta love Calbi. Good stuff. Back to it. Man, I've had Calbi like twice this week, and I still want more. Maybe three times actually. Help! I don't have enough Calbi. <laughs> It's the Christopher Walken meme that we always needed. Gotta have more cow. You know what? I don't think we've had enough beef yet. Let's have a ribeye. Yeah. And some soup. So, uh, I, I only found this out like maybe a week or two ago, and I feel really stupid, but th this place we, I just ate at, Ikenari Steak? That's a real steakhouse. Oh no. I mean, I feel like the mm. ones that have special events, whatever, are all real. Oh no, totally. Like, regardless. Well, maybe, but, but like, that's a real poster behind this dude. Now, we are talking with a digitized version of the president of Ikenari Steak. That's dope. I. I kind of wish it, more games it, did that. Yeah. This isn't the first time the RGG studio has done this, too. I'm pretty sure they've done this at least twice. I just want to put this. it out there. That's a really weird effect on the paper because it, it looks more like it's like a heat, you know, wave. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, it does. Like, I get what they're going for, but. <laughs> yeah. it's like, anyway, it's like, damn, is that where all the fire from the grill goes? <laughs> <laughs> I know it's winter, but. Anyway, this is, uh, President, uh, Ichinose, here to sell you his steaks. Huh? Don't you recognize my face? <laughs> right I'm only, here? I'm only standing in front of it. <laughs> they say if I look over my left shoulder, I'll see myself. <laughs> if I see my reflection, <laughs> winter lasts two weeks longer. But everyone gets like half off on steaks. <laughs> so yeah, the, the President Ichinose, Ichinose's uh, whole friendship event is basically a long extended commercial for Ikenari steaks. On all, yeah, he's probably earned it. Let's be fair. Yeah, probably. I'm not gonna lie, it, this does make me want steak too. I'm pretty sure they have a couple of uh, locations in New York, too. So maybe the next time I'm there, I could uh, give that a go. All right. Uh, question for you and Thread. If you happen to have a like, professionally done poster of you for whatever activity, say, like, it's, you know, say, in a stakes, um, and no matter what, every day you had to pass in front of that poster, would you eventually be annoyed by it, or would you, like, like it until the end of time? I would... I would probably be the kind to just, like, get a little annoyed with it. See, I would... I wouldn't get annoyed with it, but I'd probably start, like, heading stuff on it, you know? <laughs> I'd just give myself, like, a sick beard. <laughs> <laughs> or, like, draw a battle axe, you know, whatever. Hmm... Yeah, the, uh, the strong bad school of uh. I said graffiti. consummate V's. <laughs> ah yes, giving yourself consummate V's. <laughs> Dear strong bad. <laughs> uh, don't don't get the boxing gloves on. 
<laughs> Don't forget the nice beefy arm in the back. Hmm. So, um, yeah, I, I feel like the best manager would be someone who innovates, but, uh, Ichinose has different ideas. Uh, it's going to be the one on the right. I didn't even really see the option. Huh? There were no yep. right answers. Yup. <laughs> We just gotta get this extended steak commercial in. I hate this place now. <laughs> <laughs> you made me think there was a right answer in the four you were given. I gotta be honest though, um, I'm always like surprised. I, I don't feel like I see it enough in, uh, especially not my time. But like in North America in general, I feel like there's no like, you know, here's the menu outside with like either the full menu or just like uh, printed anything with like pictures and shit. Hmm. I really feel like that's more of a European such Asian thing. To have. Yeah, you see it a lot in Japan. I, I, I I've seen it a, li a couple of times, like in in Boston, but mm -hmm. not super often. In my town of uh, Toronto, Montreal, uh, you totally, like, you never see it. You, you, like, there's exceptions, of course, but, like, it's definitely not the norm. Hmm. I feel like it's the sort of thing that, you know, you don't need to invest a lot into it, and you get a big return. Right, right. I mean, number of times I, like, wanted to eat somewhere, it's like, ah, I wish I could see what hmm. the food looks like. <laughs> Yeah, I, I find, like, Japanese restaurants are pretty nice about, like, at least having, uh, mock-up displays of what the food looks like outside. Mm. Like, you see it a lot in, like, these games, but, uh, there, there are a couple, like, Japanese places near where I live that, uh, that do it too. Right, right. It's kind of weird seeing the food, like, like that, just kind of preserved. But also, it does tell you what the food is going to look like, and, uh, you know what? I can appreciate that. Yeah. If I see a nice plate of, like, I don't know, fucking uh, katsu curry, maybe I want some katsu curry. Yeah, exactly. It's like um, there's a there's a barcade close to my place, and they do pierogies, but like there's no photos of the pierogies. So, mm. and it's like that's pretty much like their only menu item. So the. It'd be nice to see, like, okay, how many am I getting? What's it look like? Like, what's what does it come with? You kind of just have to, like, you know, throw yourself into it to, to test it out. Right, right. And, you know, the pierogies are good, so it's great. But, you know, I, I could see how some people would be like, oh, I'm not really sure what I'm getting into, so I'd, I'd rather not. Yeah. Nani? So, um... Yeah, the last event with uh, President Ichinose is um, is where he fires his one of his workers because he doesn't understand the true meaning of good cooking with Ichinose. Almost. He's like, "You're on thin ice, buddy." So yeah, you're right. He he doesn't understand the true spirit of the the business or whatever. So, uh... I think we can reliably prove that Yelp does not exist in Japan. <laughs> <laughs> All right. yeah, I just kept getting big Hit question him. marks every... <laughs> I just kept getting big question marks every time I tried to go to Yelp when I was there. <laughs> I really wish Ichinose had like hit this guy because he's like, who even uses whom these days? That's not the point. <laughs> 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 Don't. <laughs> this is an ad hominem almost. <laughs> Attack the argument, goddammit. If only most. If not, 99% of all corporations thought like Ichinose. 
and remember too, this is a promotion with the actual with the company, so maybe they don't actually think like this. Fair enough. I I mean I hope they do because I think that would be great, but I'm putting. I'm not, you, I'm I'm not gonna hold my breath. Alrighty, Canary. I'm putting you solidly in the maybe try category. <laughs> I was really hyped for your stuff. Now not so much. I mean, either way, it's a it is a pretty good looking steak. You know what it really is? I think it's because his hat's not tall enough for me. <laughs> anyway, uh, to to really learn the spirit of how this business stays together, is he he's assigning his assistant to a uh, retail duty. So is there a reason for the rocket ship as their logo? I have no idea. Oh. I didn't... That sure reminds me of, like, Planet Express. I only just learned Ikenari Steak was a real brand, like, maybe <laughs> two or three weeks ago. Like, so... Like, I expect deep dives here, as soon as you learn about them. Arigato. I was just more mind-blown about the fact that, you know, President Ichinose is a real person. That is his likeness we are speaking to. He is standing in front of hmm? a digitized version of a real poster of himself. Like, could be, just the could thought of that is fuck. I know it could be way worse, but just the thought of this is really throwing me for a loop. You're t okay. I just want to point out you're com. I don't want to say complaining because you you know you just seem flabbergasted by this. When wasn't it uh, near that had a bonus boss that was like the CEO of Sony or whatever? <laughs> Square Enix. Square but Enix, yes, sorry. yes. I, you know, Near Automata has that too. But like, I, I, they, they were upfront about that one. This is just like this one blindsided me out of nowhere. <laughs> like I just randomly, like, I was looking up something on Game Facts, and then some, and then someone mentions, oh yeah, you can already stakes is fucking real. And it's like what? <laughs> I'm glad to hear that Game Facts is still alive and kicking. I also found out that the guy writing most of the walkthroughs for I, I've been using for, you know, the, these these LPs uh, is kind of closest to my area. Yeah, I think you mentioned that in the last video. Anyway, the cat's over there at the that end of the uh, the alleyway. So let's 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 look for the security camera now. Yeah, it's in that garbage. Uh huh. What the? Get out of my way. <laughs> there it is. There, that That's really all there is to this uh, investigation. Man, it's gonna suck when it turns out that the camera is either broken or turned the wrong way. Yeah, that would suck, wouldn't it? Huh? What's that? Whose footprints are these? A surveillance camera? Oh, indeed. What's a Russian gunship doing in the middle of Shinjuku? <laughs> hey, you! Heard you like spotting cameras in dark alleys. Marase. Oh, good. Marase's back. Coincidence. Clear your schedule. Cause I'm gonna take my time with you. Boys! Get this fucker back to the office! <laughs> I really don't have time for this. Hey, parkour. You talk! <laughs> Kaito san. Stay the fuck out of this! Where are you? <laughs> Come on! That was pretty sweet, man. Hey, you want to try helping out? Sure. Thing. I'll show you my audition for NGPW. You two fuckers are going down now. Okay, now it's time for the real boss fight with uh Marase. Ah! And we have Kaito helping us out this time. I was kind of hoping that Kaito would come in with like a tuck tuck or something, you know. <laughs> Let's go then. So um, I didn't get to go into it, but. Much, but when you're in EX boost mode, you are basically invincible, and any damage you take will just take off more meter, which shortens how long you're in EX boost mode. 
and for both styles, you get a special rush combo when you when you mash the triangle button. Um, and the final hit of the combo will be something called EX Finishing Blow. Also, when you're in EX Boost Mode, you can do co-op heat actions or EX actions with Kaito. That was pretty sweet, man. <laughs> yeah, so, um, this is the uh, f finishing move for Crane Style. Now, I, I admit this is, like, kind of pretty dope, but it would probably get to me to have to go through the animation all the time. You know, you would think that, but... It never gets any less dope. Like, <laughs> like it's, it's always a joy watching these. Like, the choreography on these fights is amazing. Mm. It's certainly well done. Um, if you miss that QTE, are you, like, dead? I don't think you're dead. You just take a lot of damage, probably. Weak. Okay, so now Murase's in his second phase and he can do mortal blows now, so let's nip that in the bud, like, right now. I was really hoping that he would just look at you and be like, MEDIOCRE! <laughs> here's, here's the other co-op heat action you can do with Kaido. Alright, so, so because I can see it, uh, how good is Kaito at not taking damage? Uh, he's he's not great, but honestly, now that it's just Marase, he'll be fine. Um, I, I do want to bring this up now. Kaito fights in a variant of um a certain Legends uh brawler style. I, I think it just straight up is brawler style. Um, in the the files for Kiwami 2, um, modders have found uh. A, I think they actually did just straight up find the brawler style in the files, which, you know, got used here. They, they also found some, um, unfinished versions of, like, Yagami's train style, I think? So, yeah, Kiwami 2, I think they, they were using as their test bed for this game. Nice. Anyway, that's the EX move for the, the sledgehammer. I was really hoping for, like, numbers to appear over him. And, right? <laughs> and be like, you you won the prize. <laughs> you punch real hard. But yeah, I I, I, I love going into co-op fights with a, a ton of meter built up so I can just go into EX boost Please and uh, do a ton of you EX did, moves. Right? It's yeah, great. Definitely looks like a lot of fun. I think I did. Check out that camera. We're in the clear if the thing puts Hamura here at midnight. And if it doesn't, let's let's try and stay on. I'll just have to poke out this guy's eyes and you toss him in the trash. Well, camera, <laughs> you got good news for us or what? <laughs> By the way, we're gonna have to delete this footage because we don't want to be incriminated. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> This video shows everything you need to see. My client, Hamura-san, drunkenly attacked this passerby on the night of the murder. Then, after the altercation, that same passerby watched Hamura-san walk into Sana Goten. But how could he do that if he was allegedly killing a man? Nobody came out of the building after that, until the train started in the morning meaning the defendant was accounted for during the hours in question. The defense asserts that this video establishes a clear alibi, which can only be seen as proof of Hamura-san's innocence. To that end, I have a question for the prosecution. Did you have any prior knowledge of this video before the trial began? I assure you that we reviewed all the relevant footage from the sauna. And yet the defendant was nowhere to be found, Counsel. At least so I was told. Meaning, you never actually went to examine the site personally then. Would you say that's correct? Yes. My associates took care of that. 
Nonetheless, the defense's video is far too blurry to clearly identify either participant. There's no way to tell whether the man in the footage was the defendant or just a random pedestrian. Damn, I can't believe he called us out on using Sony's products. Thank you very much. <laughs> in that case, the defense would like to call a witness to the stand. Wiggle waggle. How do we still have such bad looking hair? Yeah, he styles it very, um, liberally, we'll say. Say, Asan, do you claim you're the person in this video? That someone assaulted you that night? Is that accurate? No. Yes, it is. Now tell us, this person who assaulted you, are they here in the courtroom? <laughs> hmm? Witness, is there a problem? I, um... Hmm? I must have been mistaken. I am the one getting hit in the video, but as to who the other guy was, I can't say. Excuse me, Your Honor. Uh, recess, if you don't mind. I can't testify. He said he would kill all eight of my wives. What happened in there? Oh, no. I... I, I can't... Is he gonna start with the clingy one first? So sorry. But why? You were all ready to go this morning. I... got a phone call earlier. Go on. It said it was from my sister. There was a strange man on the line. It's almost like this is something you could admit to the cops. Marase told me you know him, Yagami-san. Marase. I don't know. When the Yag says threatening you, threatening you, I don't know if you want to go to the cops. He said, I mean, you know, it's... If I did, I'd never If you don't, you're kind of... Like, it's not like this guy's performance isn't like, okay, guys, uh, we're, we got questions here. Kaito-san. Yeah, I know. <laughs> like, there's no way this looks good for anybody. No, it does not. Heading over there now. Could use a hand. I guess I just like dislike this cliche, you know? Do it. Yeah, it's it, it's so overdone. Smile but... doesn't mean it's like, oh, if I talk, they do something to my sister, and it's like, okay, cool. But like, just as much time show as the can. phone to your cops. I'll get to say a sister back. They're tapping it. <laughs> I've I've read the Patriot Act. I think I'll be the one to drag you out. Promise. Just be like, hey, uh, cops, I know this is kind of a weird request for me to, to ask for, but would you mind going to 12345 Bronson Avenue because my sister lives there and I'm pretty sure someone just finished calling me and threatening her life. 